Joining me right now with the Mesa County Library, Miss Andrea Hamilton. Thank you for coming on today. How are you doing? I'm doing really well. Thanks for asking. Yes. So, yeah, thanks so much for having me here today to talk about this event. So, yes, ma'am. Well, let's just dive right into it. Mm -hmm. This is a very thoughtful event, and I feel like mm -hmm. it's a timely event. And um, so, can you talk a little bit about what the teen self care event is? Yeah, so just to give some context, the teen self care fair, this is our second year doing it. Um, last year went fairly well, so we wanted to go again. And it is to highlight free and low cost services for teens in our area, um, particularly with a mental health aspect. So that includes th traditional things like, you know, local therapy organizations like Counseling and Education Center. But it does also include other things like art opportunities, music opportunities. So it's a wide spectrum of things. That's yes, a plethora of things. Um, so how did this, how did this come about? Yeah, so this was actually something that my manager um, saw originally suggested by the Fort Collins Museum of Discovery. Um, they hosted one a few years back, and I believe it's still ongoing. And we just loved that idea of a way to approach mental health conversations, particularly with teens and their families, that has a more positive aspect as well as focusing on, you know, Thing, classic things like suicide prevention, but also talking about um, positive social opportunities for teens as well. Um, you know, rather than kind of sneaking in, you know, the vegetables in with the spaghetti, as it were. Um, you know, having some fun opportunities like you know getting to hang out with therapy dogs, but also having um, access to information about local therapy in our area. So. Wonderful. So it sounds like, if I'm hearing you correctly, you, you guys have incorporated fun things for the teenagers mm -hmm. to do while creating a serious topic mm -hmm. that's very time relevant in the, mm -hmm. with, with what's going on in the world right now. Absolutely. So Yes, yeah. ma'am. Uh, so really quick, is there any age group? Like, is there a minimum mm -hmm. age group for this? Well, we do um, target this event for teens ages 12 to 18. Okay. Um, and that doesn't mean that people from other age groups can't come. It's just kind of that's where the focus is um, of providing specifically resources and opportunities that are targeted for those age groups. So. Yes, ma'am. And um, one more time, what day is the event and what time is the event yeah. going to be? So that event is going to be on Saturday, May 6th from 12 to 3. Okay, wonderful, Ms. Andrea. I want to thank you so much for taking some time out of your day and um, doing such a wonderful thing for the youth. I think that's a very important thing that you guys are doing out there. Well, thank you so much. Yeah, we're really looking forward to it. It's going to be super fun. Free food, um, inflatable jousting, therapy dogs. Um, there's just going to be so many fun things to do. So. Well, you heard it here first, Western Slope.